I think I just, <laughs> I think I just really just, um, we're going to go ahead and get off into this, man. Um, and greetings, peace and blessings, love and light, health and wholeness to the third. For those who don't understand what that means, that's, you know, three times. <clears throat> because um, if it's a hell, man, everything in hell don't try to, you know, stop. I don't know how many times I don't started this video and my technology being, you know, this technology being attacked, you know, like something trying to prevent it, you know. So I don't want to, um, take two. I don't want to, I, I want to get off into this. Create, create some, uh, protection. To save for y'all, you know. As I introduce y'all into my sacred space, I'm going to make a sacred space for y'all. But, um. Yeah, man. The word for the day, I'm going to get right off into this. Give me a second. Because it's hot out here. <laughs> and, um, it take resilience. <laughs> you know, so, first of all, I want to salute mothers, man. I want to salute females. You know, I, I, I really want to tip my hat to y'all. Um, because um, yeah, I have a lot to do with what inspired I didn't know this in the beginning but y'all have the majority to do with what inspired the word that I'm going to bring for the day and the reason being because I come from a mother and um, it take resilience man <laughs> you know a, a resilience that a man can never have, a strength a man can never have. It takes resilience, you know, to carry a child. And then um, most women end up raising the child or the children that they have by themselves. So that's another type of resilience. So I salute, you know, the feminine, the feminine presence, the divine feminine in women for that ability. Um, oh, I salute all you, I salute all you, um, outdoor men, you work, especially if you, if you, if you, if you in hot states, man, you know, cause it take resilience to be able to, it take, man, look, I can meditate all day, long as you want in the sun, but to work in this, and, 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 and that's one type of resilience, but to work in this, for eight hours a day, man, that's a whole nother type of resilience. So I salute you, man, your labors. Shout out to one, one that done pressure washing in Florida. If y'all in Florida, holla at one that done pressure washing. He get the job done, first time. Um, but we're gonna get on off into this message. You know, I brought some things out here to share with y'all. I'll give you a quick uh, uh, scan. You know, and, and, and we're going to get off into it, you know, hopefully we don't have no, um, <laughs> no more technological interruptions. But uh, the word for the day was resilience. Resilience. So we're going to start with resilient, rebounding, recoiling, springing back, flexible. Bendable, pliable, supple, springy, bouncy, tensile, stretchable, extensile, extensible, contractible, contractive, elastic, rubbery, plastic, ductile, mm. malleable, adaptable, yielding, recuperative, lively, Jaunty, lighthearted, breezy, perky, light, carefree, airy, cheerful, resilience. Because remember, I'm in my JA synonym finder. I'm going to say a lot of things, and I might, you might see me do a lot of things that even if you don't understand them, at the time, it's something that you could 
check in too and maybe perhaps learn something, you know? What I do is only, you know, what I do is right for me. That's why Sawu do it, you know? But everybody here for what they here for. But I'm doing what's the core to and part of my life purpose. And that's what I'm sharing and extending with y'all. Um, resilience. They take resilience, man. So from the from resilience, as as we always do, I was led to this other book. I'm gonna stop saying this other book. You know, this book precious to me. Um, because it belonged to my mother. And um she trans she she transitioned, you know, but she's still here. <laughs> we vibe all the time. But um this book by Joyce Myers called Starting Your Day Right. So this the book, one of the books I've been making reference to. And I'm doing this, I'm sharing with y'all for I'm really like personal about what I do when I do what I do. But I'm glad to, you know, share some things, share some things with y'all for whoever need to hear it, for, for you know, for whoever may, may, may need a good book that they can read, you know, but this is the book that I, um, I guess my mama been, you know, on me, and I've been grabbing this book for the past week or so, and it's um, part of what I've been sharing with y'all, you know, but um, what I open to in um, correspondence with the word resilient being pressed upon my spirit, and I opened the page <laughs> and it said, don't get upset. Don't get upset. So when I pay attention to everything that's going on, I see, I'm, I'm seeing a synchronicity, you know, <clears throat> a very strong synchronicity in my life, a very strong alignment in my life. But don't get upset. And as usual, with this book, it comes to scripture. So I'm gonna be reading from Ephesians 3:16. For those who are in the, into the Bible, into you know my Christian brethren, I'm gonna be reading from Ephesians 3:16 because I have no no idea who may be, who may be watching this. So you know I'm not um <laughs> an activist for for any religion, creed, or doctrine. Um, I do what I'm inspired to do, and that's what I and that's what comes forth from me. Um, but Ephesians 3:16, don't get upset. And the scripture that applied to don't get upset was, <clears throat> may he, whoever he or she or whatever you know, may he grant you out of the rich treasury of his glory to be strengthened and reinforced with mighty power in the inner man by the Holy Spirit himself and dwelling your innermost being and personality. So how I, how I would apply that to myself, you know, because I don't, because God is not external from me. God is my internal being, you know, outpoured, outpoured and manifested through this flesh. So, may the source in me, out of the rich treasury of source, glory to be strengthened and reinforced with mighty power in the inner man by my higher self, for himself, and dwelling in the innermost of my being and personality. To have power in your life, you got to speak power over your life. To have power in your life, you gotta speak power over your life. And when you get upset, wow. And when you get upset, <laughs> it disconnects the power that you have. This book further reads, it's, 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 it's wild, but 
The devil sets us up to get upset so that we act ugly, throw fits, and ruin our witness of what God or source or the creator or the higher power has done in our lives. Without God's love flowing through us, without source love flowing through us, it is hard to be nice to nice people. Mm. Without the love of source flowing through us, it is hard to be nice to nice people let alone to treat difficult people nicely. We need sources help to live well. So may all be well. The Holy Spirit will give you the power to walk in love everywhere you go. Don't leave home without it. MasterCard, American Express, Visa, whoever, don't leave home because that can't save you. It's going to take something in you and that's greater than everything we see to do what needs to be done for you. So don't leave home without it because you never do. You take it with you everywhere you go. This thing called God, this thing called Source, a higher power. We take it with us everywhere we go. We never leave home without it. But the problem is that we forget. Or we just don't know. Because somebody ain't told us what we are. But we never leave home without it. So don't leave home without inviting source to fill you with the grace to demonstrate God's love and compassion towards everyone you meet. And I don't think there's no greater form of resilience <laughs> than to be able to do that. That take resilience. It take resilience to be nice to people when they treating you like you know what. <laughs> it take resilience to stay at that job when You are aware people less qualified than you getting paid more than you. It take resilience, <laughs> man. These last four months, man, all of us been trained in resilience. We been in, we been in real training because it take resilience. It, it just, just to wake up and 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 want to keep doing this sometimes. But the, will to, but the will to live in all of us, <clears throat> for those who have it, and, and continue to allow us to get up and keep doing it. That's resilience. Hold on. I had to walk, I had to get up and walk around a little bit. Um, Cause it takes resilience. <laughs> But um, before I stray, I want to um, go into some things I said I was going to share with y'all. So, these stones, these, these from my personal set. For y'all into stone and crystals, man, you know, get, put your sun and put your, put your crystals and stuff out in the, in, 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 the, uh, in the sun and charge them up, man. Put them out here in the ground and, the, and charge them up, man. We got some lapis lazuli, some amethyst, bloodstone. Got some copper, you know. Got some uh, pink quartz, clear quartz, smoky quartz, you know. Got my master, got my got my ma got my master, my master start out <laughs> for the master teachers, you know. Got my uh, Metatron Medi cube out here. I got some. Uh, I got my old goon, you know. My old goon lamp is made with adventuring, custom made, you know, for the heart chakra. You know, I'm a light, <clears throat> I'm a I'm a light worker. So if, for those light workers out there, if you if if you really doing work, you know, you aware, you got to be aware of the light and the dark. You know, we operating in both. You know, we operating in it. We're both we're both with masculine and feminine. You know, yin and yang, light and dark. You know, the true the true magician know that. You know, I got my, my old bottle law, Leke, 
You know, I got me some hematite. I got my petrified wood and natural wood out here. You know, with tiger eye on it. Got me some sage, of course. Y'all gotta keep, y'all gotta keep y'all some sage burner, man. You hear me? You know, for my Reiki, for my Reiki clients, when I have to do Reiki sessions for people, you know, I got my, I got my setup out here, and I go through these in a minute. I got, I got my J bird, you see, cause we connected. I got, I got my clear quartz pendulum. I got some pink quartz, some more pink quartz. Some amethyst. Can y'all see it? I'm trying to get it right for y'all. Some amethyst. Some pink quartz in case this ain't come through. Got a clear quartz uh, obelisk. And I got a golden. For those who don't know about that golden quartz, man, it's powerful. You better get you some. A golden quartz obelisk. You know? These are just the fruit things amongst the, uh, the many things <laughs> that you will find in the realm of Sawu. You know? Um, let me tell you about going to these, what these Reiki stones for. Each one serve a purpose. We got some garnet for the root. I got some carnelian for the sacrum. I use personally tiger eye for your solar. I got some amazonite, amazonite for the heart chakra. Lapis lazuli for the throat. Amethyst for the third eye. Clear quartz for the crown chakra. You know, that's just my little Jay Bird, man. He just chilling. <laughs> But, um, yeah. Oh, I protect them with, uh, with, 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 with my blue bag, you know. And I keep, I keep my personal stone devil protected in a black mesh bag. Then a purple velvet bag. They got, they got them in all colors. But, um, it's resilience just to get up and do what I do every day. For people, cause I deal in I deal in energy. I'm a healer, you know. We all healers in some aspect, none other. But that just happened to be my profession. I'm a healer, you know. I operate in spirit, you know. But um, resilience, man. I mean, we all walk in resilience, you know. Cause just to live is life changing stuff. Once again, peace and blessings, love and light. Health and wholeness. And until next time, one life, one love. I enjoyed this. This it was a pleasure. It was a pleasure. This I would have God.